I'm Jennifer Angel. This is your Stars Cancer for week commencing September the 30th. Now, the moon, this month's new moon is in your solar fourth house. Of course, being ruled by the moon, anything that happens with the moon over the month is going to affect you strongly. So being in your solar fourth house is all to do with your home. It is a position of your solar chart as, as well and so the fourth house is very close to your heart let's say um, it's all to do with your home family your domestic scene it also brings in self-nurturing so this is a time where it indicates with the, the new moon in this position which means the sun and the moon are in the same position there where you can should be looking at just looking after yourself a little bit better so it's all very well to reach out to other people cancer which you're very good at doing and that's one of the things that people love so much about you but it's time sometimes just to sit back and think what about me you need to just focus on what's good for you as well and recharge your energies which means taking in a level of nurturing and pampering whatever that is to you maybe it's a massage uh, maybe it's sitting down and reading a book perhaps it's just getting some peace and quiet away from everybody else for a while so only you can answer that all right so in your solar fifth house which is also a very personal area of your chart um, we've got venus um, mercury the communication planet and uh, Saturn. Saturn has been in there for a while. It's a slower moving planet that's in there for a little while yet. So in this area, it's very important with communications that you're having with relationships, particularly as this week there is also a square with Pluto. And Pluto is sitting there right in your area of relationships, another slow moving planet. Make sure with any communications that you have that you speak from the heart, as always, and make it clear. So you don't want to be giving mixed messages. And if you're not clear about what you want in your life or what you want to achieve, which is the first step, then it can come through with a level of confusion. Okay, and so that's what you want to just focus on. There are, is also an opposition between the Sun and Uranus this week, which indicates that there's some type of conflict that's happening between your work and home life. So, and changes can happen when disruption is happening sometimes you want to just get out of your own way let things settle down before you move forward okay all right have a great week cancer i'm jennifer angel thanks so much for watching and i look forward to seeing you next week bye for now